Good afternoon, and welcome to Coffee with Mr. Steyer. This time around, I'm rocking my mug from uh, Shawshank Prison, uh, which is in uh, Mansfield, Ohio. I got to see that last year. and Got myself a handy little mug, so get enjoy it in mid-afternoon. Mid-afternoon coffee is great because it wakes you up for the evening. And uh, if I have it too late, then I have to stay up all night because I'm just uh, too wired. So anyways, uh, it is Saturday, so hopefully you're enjoying your weekend. Uh, two weeks in, I hope you're doing well with this. I uh, just want to talk to you a little bit about what's coming up and uh, what your expectations can be. Uh, first of all, the good news, no state testing this year. So that is out the window, so you don't have to worry about that anymore. Even if we do go back to school, it's not going to happen, um, so don't worry about that. Uh, otherwise... I know we're still in this for at least another week, probably more. Um, I'm not sure when it's going to end, um, so just keep on keeping on. Do the best that you can. I know some people are feeling a little bit overwhelmed in terms of your work. Uh, my big suggestion for that is just every day, get up, treat it like it's a school day. I'll try to have my stuff posted um, by uh, between eight and eight, but no, between nine and ten o'clock each day. Uh, you know that if you stay on it, it doesn't take you longer than 35, even less time than that to work on it. So stay on top of your stuff. Do it every day. Make a checklist if you need to. So that way you can say that's done, that's done, that's done. Um, but that's the key is you got to stay on top of it because we are not going back to school well, one more time. These uh, grades are going to be for your fourth quarter, and your fourth quarter is going to dictate your fall stuff. So eighth graders, that's for high school sports, and for seventh graders, it's for your eighth grade uh, year for the fall for sports. So please try and stay on top of that if you can. Uh, otherwise, it's a Saturday, so I hope this weekend you get to go outside and enjoy the weather. Go walk somewhere. Take your dog out. Go wave at your grandma from the end of the sidewalk. We actually did that today, too, for my mom and my wife's mom. Um, so anyways, um, try something new. Bake. Uh, cook. Clean your room. Uh, work on a, a hobby. And that's actually what I'm doing downstairs right now is I have my own little hobby. I'm wearing my Gene Simmons Kiss apron. And no, I'm not barbecuing because I'm actually in my rec room. In case uh, you can't see that, I'm an old man trying to figure out how to turn, th turn this thing around. But anyways, uh, I am currently working on uh, my own things here. And I am trying to turn this around, but it's not helping me. I think I just took a picture of myself. But anyways, here's what I'm working on. I am turning uh, this guy into this guy, who would be Mr. T. And some of you guys know that I actually work on my wrestling figure, so uh, there's how all of those are. And this is my fun little rec room of enjoyment. Basically my hobbies, my wrestling stuff, my movie monster stuff, and my workout stuff. But I think that's important as you guys uh, are in this for the long haul. Find something you enjoy. Um, practice something. Uh, if you're not good at drawing, try drawing. If it doesn't work, do something else. But anyways, um, try to make good use of your time. Don't sit on your computers all the time. Don't sit on your Playstations all the time. Get up and be active. Um, just try to find something that will help you stay positive. So I'm trying to do that on my end. So enjoy the rest of your weekend. Get some coffee, coffee if you need some. I certainly do. And uh, just uh, give your family a hug and call somebody, call grandma, call grandpa, call someone that you haven't uh, talked to in a while, family members, and let them know that you're thinking about them. So uh, have yourself a good weekend and I'll check back up with you on Monday.